my eyebrows are horrendous right now. But I'm waiting to go get them done with my friend Brooke. I'm getting ready to pack my things up for school. Um, so I'm going up to the attic to get some boxes and move out of my room. Um, right now my room's kind of a mess. There's some stuff there. There's a massive box. It's messy to me. But, yeah. I'm coming up. I think I have to put those away from our trip. Into the attic we go. Alright. And we have a light switch. Okay, here it is. I'm gonna go through and grab here's my stuff, school break boxes, and pack those up. Okay, so those are my boxes. That's about what I leave. And then I have to figure out how to get that massive box. It's pretty big, you can't tell from here, but um, and then this is the rest of the clothes that I have um, that I need to pack up. Some shoes, that's my suitcase. And then we got to get all the stuff ready for the new student to come in and I have hair product and makeup I need to figure out what to do with as well. Probably ship a few boxes, maybe not that one because that one's super big. And like it comes up to like mid thigh on me, like height wise. So it's it's a large box. But yeah, I'm gonna go through, um, set some stuff aside, start doing laundry, folding things. This is to give away. This is Ryan's. I might go through and give some of my stuff away also to one of the families at our church. <sighs> my little plant over here. It's kind of dying. Sorry, buddy. I'll water you before I leave. But, yep. I'm going to miss my little view. It's a little bit cloudy and gray outside today. Because of the uh, fires that have been going on. But... Yep. I'm gonna take a video of you. Get it, pony. Where are we going? Now is see it's over here. Oh, reminds me of Kobe. <laughs> oh no, they're dying. Yeah. I was just looking, you know. Yeah, there's some over there too. Where's Where's there? Why don't you ask me what you need? I was <laughs> I don't need anything. I was just looking. Why do you have to look? What? Why do you have to look? Just Why not? But... Post its no parents. Puppy. Plant update. Look at him. He's doing so much better. He's not as droopy. So I finished packing. Um, I'm gonna ship these two boxes. This is just a bunch of books. This is some of my like formal clothes. Oh, I, the tape keeps coming off, which is driving me kind of crazy. Um, that stuff, kind of miscellaneous things that were just accumulating in my room. I'll take that. I'll take this and this. That's my medicine. Um, the box is empty. This is stuff that I will have in this backpack, so that's good to go. I'll leave that stuff here. That suitcase is packed, fam. Um, I'm wearing those pants. Those can fit in my backpack. But yeah, those are my boxes. Um, I have a couple more things that I'm going to stick in there before I, um, put them back up into the attic. Still have the clothes there. Still need to give those away. Um, yeah, so that is it. I'm gonna miss this little room. I'm gonna clean it some more. Uh, I'm actually working on the YouTube video um, that I started. I filmed most of that packing yesterday. I cannot believe it. I wake up this morning. Oh, I'll, I'll switch it. Closing the window because somebody is doing their lawn very loudly. So, um, I found my scrunchie. So that was like a major win. Um, this morning um, perks of packing you figure out where everything is that you brought <laughs> um, but yeah so I said I was um, editing my video for you guys and um, I'm having a lot of fun with it actually so 
Um, yeah, oh, I was gonna say, um, I woke up this morning and I was like, I leave tomorrow and I just like could not believe it. Um, I actually, maybe I can perch this up next to my plant. Oh, that's nice, I like that. Um, and I was like, I'm wearing really short shorts today. Um, but I was like, ah, I can't believe it. And I um, decided like last night, I had the best sleep I've had in weeks. Like I have been having like a hard time sleeping, kind of like stressed out about um, my health stuff that's been going on and like school starting up, which I'm excited about, but also like I had to pack all my things and just the idea of like not knowing what was gonna be after that. So like, what do I leave at home and what do I leave at school or bring with me? Like what should I even bother bringing back and hauling back and forth? And so, um, yeah, I talked to my mom about that a lot yesterday, which was really awesome. Um, and practiced a little bit of gratitude last night before bed. And I think honestly, guys, that that made the whole difference. Cause I just like took, I don't know how long it was probably like, it felt like 10 minutes, but it was probably like 60 seconds if that, um, of just being grateful for things. And so I tried that again this morning and I feel a lot better. So, um, yeah, I'm really excited about that. I'm going to try to incorporate that more frequently into my everyday stuff. Um, and then I read, I'm reading this for class. Um, it is Rick, Swar Rick Warren's The Purpose Driven Life devotional book thing. Um, it's really good, actually. It's kind of honesty time. Y'all are friends, so I can be honest like this. But, like, the chapters are a little bit long for me. Um... It's kind of redundant a lot of stuff that I've grown up hearing because um, this came out I don't know when but I know it was really popular when I was younger I think 2002 yeah copyright 202 2002 um, so yeah really good though um, to kind of get a grasp on your purpose your calling um, and how that can intertwine into everyday life and your work and your vocation and um, even just your own personal relationship with Jesus, which, that's good. So, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Uh, I'm going to run some errands, finish that YouTube video. Uh, I haven't eaten breakfast yet. I've been up for a few hours, but I just wasn't hungry right away. So, um, I'm going to go do that and then finish this video. So, I'll see you guys. And I'll probably make a video about actually leaving um, tomorrow and then get it up sometime by the end of this week. So... Yay, I can't wait to see everyone in Springfield.